baby? It's your boy Chef Daddy OG, baby. HollandsLanesRadio.com. What up, Chef? You was involved in the program, right? That's it. Talk on it. Speak on it, baby. It was a great day. The girls participated well. They know how to make eggplant roll TV now. Cook a little Italian food for them. It was fun. They had Forget a good about time. it. Forget, Forget about it. it. Forget <laughs> about it. That's what it do, man. Nice meeting you. Nice meeting you. Chef, you know what I'm saying? It's your boy, Chef Daddy OG for HollandsLanesRadio.com. You was one of the chefs involved in the program, right? Yes. Talk on, speak on it, baby. We had a great time. <laughs> there were people from all ages. We cooked, we ate, and we had fun. I see you got a collar around your neck. Um, it is a collar. And it is out of this town. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I am an Episcopal priest, and um, this is my way of saying hi, community, hi, kids, hi to everybody. Come on, so let's you, pray, let's be grateful. Let's so you be... cook and bless the food at the same time, huh, baby? Well, uh, God bless the food, and I cook it for you. <laughs> That's what it is. Thanks, Lasha. Yeah. Bye-bye. What up, baby? It's your boy, Chef Daddy OG. I'm LaneMayu.com, and I'm chilling with the president of the YWCA. We go on the program, baby. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> we going to tell them about the program. Well, it's been a great opportunity for the senior citizens of Yonkers and the young women of Yonkers to get together and to cook together, to cook for each other, and to enjoy each other's company and to learn from each other. So I'm happy as could be about it. I think you're doing a real good job. I was one of the chefs that participated in the program, and, and the girls got really involved. I think it's a real good program, and also the seniors, they, they loved it too. And uh, hopefully next year it could be bigger and better. And the food was fantastic. And we have to thank you as one of our chefs for giving up your time. That was a great thing for you to do. And we're hoping we can expand it, get more seniors and more young women of Yonkers yes, here. It's, it's a real good look. I, I vouch for it. <laughs> and, yo, and thanks for having me, too. Yeah, I really well, appreciate we appreciate you. Thank okay, you. I appreciate you, too. That's HollandsLaneRadio.com, baby. Baby, it's your boy Chef Daddy OG, Holland's Lane Radio. And I'm chilling, I'm chilling with the, the woman of the hour. You know what I'm saying? The one that put a backbone in this, baby. What up, Juanita? Well, talk about it, baby. Hi, everyone. How you doing? My <laughs> name is Juanita Crosby, and I actually um, started the YCEP program, part of the YWCA. It's called Youth Community Engagement Program. The reason why we started this program was to actually give back to the senior citizens. So it's an intergenerational program. Um, up underneath our pro program, which is um, with the YWCA, and it serves girls ages 13 to 18. So today, it was a great turnout. I, very, I so much enjoyed the fact that we had a lot of people to come out and to support us today. Today was our last session. We ran this program for four weeks straight. Hopefully, we want to bring it back in September. So the more engagement that we have, the better it will be. The more partnerships we have, the better it will be. And the more interaction from the youth. So we're calling all youth ages 13 and 18 to actually come and join the program and hopefully we'll be starting it in September. I wanted to actually call um, Colin up for him to get, he's one of our chefs for today, who actually put in work um, along with the girls. Um, he's down at Wholesome Goodness, which is down at the pier here in the city of Yonkers, so I'm going to call him up. Baby. Um, like I said, I have Colin here. He's from Wholesome Goodness, which is located down at the pier. He was our chef for today. And we're just going to ask him, you know, tell us about your experience today, how everything, you know. You know, it was a really good experience. Um, the young ladies that were helping out in the kitchen, you know, it's, it's nice to see that they're 15, 16, those ones 19, and they've got huge dreams and want to do a lot of things. It's good. It's cool. What's the other young, young lady's name that wants to own the hotel? Deja. Deja? One of our okay. girls, Deja. Three of them graduating this year. That's so cool. And three of them want to own their now. They want to be in childcare, um, day, daycare centers. One of them wants to be a nurse. So it's awesome to work around kids that really have an aim in, in life and want to do something. And just to be able to feed the elderly and the, the, just the entire experience was a great one. That's what's up, baby. Yeah. So I just want to give special thanks to Colin. Oh, uh, it's my pleasure. Coming okay, today, is, I mean, the way that he put the place together, it was nothing but artwork, and I thank you for that. Um, just to let you know, we did incorporate etiquette in our program, so we definitely did do that. I mean, presentation means everything when you're putting out food and when you're 
representing it to the community. So I just want to give special thanks to all these people. Why? That's what they do, baby. What's that, the why? Oh, I'm in the way right here. <laughs> Shot right. Shot right here. Right here. That's what they do, baby. That's what's up, man. That was a good program. You know what I'm saying? I'm glad I was part of it. You know what I'm saying? And, and one thing you know, we love the kids. We love the kids. We love the kids. <laughs>